What's up, my name is Techno, but here for Troubleshoot, and in today's video, we're going to be going through a fix to a rather niche issue that I had with Osu. So, what exactly is the issue? Well, it's difficult to explain, and if you're having a similar issue, then this is probably the answer that you're looking for. So, while playing a song, I would hold down my Z or X, and I'll be dragging across the slider, and after a couple of milliseconds, my screen would get really jittery, the latency in the bottom right of my screen would jump from under 1 millisecond to above 10, and it would be super falling apart and difficult to play. But as soon as I let go of one of my keys, then everything went back to normal. I'll show you on screen what it looked like before and after this fix. It wasn't too much of an issue on slower songs, but of course, when you're adding more movement to it, this frame stuttering caused quite some issue for me, and it was very difficult to find an answer for. I went through NVIDIA optimizations, optimizing the game, compatibility mode, etc, etc, and it was in fact a rather sneaky Windows feature that I knew had existed all along, but I didn't think would affect it. So I'll go ahead and demonstrate it, then show you how to fix it, and at the end of the video, I'll go through how I got to this conclusion. So opening up OS and heading into this little demo song that I made in the editor, just to show you exactly what my issue is, I currently have my PC set up to have this issue. As you can see, as soon as I start holding down Z, my latency jumps from under one millisecond to about 10. However, if I switch between Z and X, you can see that the frame rate is improved quite a bit. My latency drops to under one again, but as soon as I hold down one, it'll jump to 10 and I'll start getting that frame stuttering again. Well, what exactly is the cause of this? Well, it's actually rather simple. First of all, hit start on your keyboard and then simply type in keyboard as such into the start menu. Then click on keyboard, which is inside of the control panel and you'll get a window like this. What exactly is causing the issue? Well, it's this character repeat over here. What exactly is it? Well, clicking in this text box and holding down Z, you'll see that it appears once and then it starts appearing quite quickly after that, after a short delay. So on a slider, I'm holding down Z, things are working fine until it starts spamming Z and then everything falls apart. So how exactly do you fix it? Well, for me, unfortunately, the solution was to disable this. So I wouldn't be able to hold down a key and have it spam like this. Instead, I had to do this and set the repeat rate to slow. Then holding down a key, you can see the rate at which it appears. It's a lot slower. However, if you need to keep it to fast, you can go ahead and change this back as soon as you open or close Osu. And you're probably wondering how does the repeat delay affect it while well, setting it to long actually lets you play for quite a bit until it starts sending the rest of the key presses. Anyways, there's no use in me explaining it without demonstrating it. This is how it was originally. All you have to do is lower the repeat rate from fast to the slowest that it can go. Click apply, tab back into Osu, and immediately without even quitting out of the song, you'll see that it's improved quite a bit. I'm holding down one key and I'm keeping a solid 144 frames and about one millisecond of latency. Switching between the two doesn't do anything as it did before. Everything's working as expected. If I were to tab out, change it back to fast, apply, tab back into Osu, you'll see that things are breaking rather quickly and we're going straight back to that 10 milliseconds latency with tons of frame drops. So with that aside, all I had to do was simply just disable this repeat rate and things work perfectly as you expect. Now, of course, this video may not be the solution that you're looking for, but if you're having this exact issue, then this is exactly what you're looking for. I could only find one other reference to this, which was a comment on a Reddit post four years ago that had a couple of responses saying it probably wasn't this. So how exactly did I come to this conclusion? Well, setting the repeat rate too fast and tabbing it to OS, if I go back to the menu, into my mods list, and I activate the automatic cursor movement, then we can take my mouse movement out of it. I've currently got my mouse plugged into my keyboard and my keyboard into my PC, obviously. I thought that the issue was coming somewhere there. So it's moving my mouse for me. All I have to do is hold down a key. And as you can see, the latency is jumping up to 10 after a couple of milliseconds. If I tap it, things are working great, but holding it, we get that same frame stuttering and high latency. Then heading back to the menu, if I change it so that it automatically presses my keyboard, all I have to do is move my mouse, then you'll notice something a bit different. This time, when we're hovering over it and not pressing anything, you can see that my latency is perfectly normal and we're not getting frame drops. So obviously it doesn't have anything to do with the actual game mechanics. Instead, it had something to do with my physical keyboard. And the only issue I could think of was something in this keyboard menu. Playing around with a couple of the options, this was the exact issue that I'm having 
And hopefully this is the issue that you've been having as well, so now you know how to fix it. Of course, if you try those last two steps and you're still having stuttering, as in you were using your keyboard or weren't using your keyboard, then this probably isn't the video for you and you should be looking at optimizing OSU. You'll be changing a couple of options in game and a lot of options inside of your Nvidia or AMD graphics card control panel, but we'll get to that in another video probably. Anyways, thank you all for watching. My name's been Technobo here for Troubleshoot. Hopefully you found this video useful and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.